Hello everyone, thanks for joining me on Stubble Meat Steel. So, I just got home from work and I got some fun mail call action. So, stay tuned, I'm gonna go get set up downstairs and open some of these packages. There's one in particular I'm super excited for, but actually all of them I'm excited for. So, let's go ahead and get these bad boys open. I'll show you what I got. All right, everybody, thanks for staying tuned. I got my sweet utility knife, but it's not any utility knife. I don't know if you can see that. It is a Valet Auto Strop utility knife, super vintage. So this particular package, I was really excited to open because this one was on back order for a long time. And then once it's off the of back order, you still gotta wait for it to come from overseas. So even when it is available, it takes forever to come. And it took him a while to update all his listing. I had emailed him because I have his, uh, his email. He was having some issues on Instagram. And he said, oh, it's available, I just gotta update the listing. And it took him a while, he must have been really busy. So, let's see here. So, everybody knows that I love a good single edge. And, not to spoil it, but I recently got into some Artist Club stuff. And so, this particular razor, I had heard nothing but amazing things about from everybody that used it. said, wow, this thing's just top shelf, you absolutely have to get it. And there was a finish that they offered, or metal, I should say, that really stood out to me. And I was like, man, that is just super cool looking. I, I need to get it in that particular uh, color. And something else I really wanted to try is these, the Schick Proline P30 Artist Club blades. I've heard amazing things about. So let's get into it. What do we got? What do we got? I don't know what happened. I cut myself somehow. Did I hit myself on the blade? <laughs> I don't think I did. <laughs> Hold on a minute. Well, how's that for a blooper for you? Cut myself and I didn't even put a blade in it yet. <laughs> so what do we have here? Oh look, I already lost the o-ring. That didn't take long. <laughs> All right. So what do we have here? Mike from Shield. And China makes this. Oh, that's why. There's a blade in the damn thing. That's why I cut myself. I cut myself on the blade that was in there. I didn't even realize there was a blade in it. So this is a Artist Club razor. Holds Artist Club blades. And I've only heard just fantastic, amazing things about this razor. And I have a bunch of razors in brass, but this particular one just really stood out to me. I just really loved all the pictures that I saw online of how it looked in the brass. So I was like, you know what? I totally need that thing. I'm gonna get it in the brass. And he had stainless steel for a while. He had aluminum for a while. And it was the brass that uh, took him a while to get back in stock. So the minute he had them available, I jumped on it. So here we go. Gem shield. Not gem, I don't know why I said gem. Shield AC razor with some sweet Schick P30 blades. All right, what do we got next? So this is another box that I'm super excited to open. I had been watching some of my uh, buddy's videos, Heiko Shaves, and I saw that he had teamed up with Timeless. And being honest, I didn't realize that Timeless worked with content creators. And so I reached out to them because there was a razor that I was looking at. And as some of you know on my channel, I'm a huge slant razor fan. And I was basically just gonna buy this with my own money because I really like the Timeless aluminum that I've got. 
And so I reached out to them on a whim to see if uh, they'd be willing to uh, let me uh, try this razor. And as you probably guessed it by now, it is the new Timeless Slant. Look at that head. It's got the little cool twist to it. Just beautiful, these razors. I love the uh, other Timeless that I've got. The, uh, the handle on these is just awesome. I really love the grip and the knurling and everything on it. And I just love a good slant razor. So I was super excited to try this and I'm uh, just thrilled and tickled that they were uh, willing to send me one to check out. So I'm super excited for that one. And then last but not least, let's see what we got over here. Oh, whoa, what do we got here? Hmm. Well, it looks like everybody's in for a surprise. I wasn't expecting this. I just ordered one thing in here. Let's see what they sent. I had talked to them after the fact, and they said that they were going to be sending me something, but I wasn't expecting it for quite a while, to be honest with you. Let's see what we got. All right. Check that out. The Yachi new brushes come with a coin style bottom, 26 millimeter. This is a synthetic. As they call this the cat, cat whiskers. They also offer it in a uh, double band badger, but uh, unpopular opinion. I haven't had the greatest luck with some badgers, so I actually wanted the synthetic, and I just love the look of this uh, caramel handle that they offered. It has like an iridescence to it. I don't know how well it's showing up on the uh, on the camera here, but. Yeah, it was just something that I was really looking forward to trying and they were out of it again for a while. And then when I had funds, they were, you know, just didn't have it. And so finally I was able to pick that up. So excited to try that new brush. Now let's check out these because I'm curious what this is myself, to be honest with you. Let's see what we got. Looks like we got a blade. Oh, no way, they sent it with it. Well, we're gonna have a regular Artist Club shave off, gentlemen. This is Yachi's new Excalibur, also takes an Artist Club blade. It, the bottom, the handle here is aluminum, and the head, I believe, is either Zamac or stainless. I don't remember if they offer this one in both or not, so I'll be, to be honest with you, I'll have to check it out and see. If I had to guess off memory, I believe this is a, a Zamac for the price offering point. So that's what that is. Looks like they gave me a mystery blade to try with it. Well, let's let's see what this one is, because now I'm really curious. I have no idea what this is. Let's check it out. Looks like another artist club blade, maybe. Let's see what we got. Whoa, no way, check that out. It's another artist club, but it looks like it is open comb. Make sure there's no blade in there. Nope, no blade in this one. <laughs> That's a cool looking handle. All right, well, now, now, now you know what's coming. We're gonna have a whole artist club razor uh, shoot off. And I also have a Razor Rock Hawk V2 to throw in there. And then I also have a mystery artist club razor that'll show off too. So got a bunch of fun stuff to, uh, compare and to have a little artist club party over here. Well, I don't want to make this video any longer than need be. This is just a fun little unboxing, so stay tuned. Got a sneak peek of some awesome stuff that you have uh, to look forward to review-wise, but uh, this right here, this is the first one I'm gonna try. I've been waiting for this thing for well over two months between the back order and the shipping and everything else. Honestly, probably almost three months now. So definitely gonna try this one first. All right, thanks for watching. Take care.